how to create a free landing page for Facebook ads. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. And in today's video, I'm going to be telling you how you can create a free landing page for Facebook ads. So having said that, let's just jump into the video. So for this video, we are going to be using systemi.io or system.io, but you can use any other website you want. It's just funnel or it's just a landing page the reason i'm using this is because you know it has a lot of options uh, when it comes to creating a landing page and funnel so it's also free as well however there is a pricing plan you can see over here but as you can see there it's free over here it's zero dollars per month so that's why i'm using it so and you can also create up to three sales funnels one blog one course unlimited blog post and you can also have uh, communities members and all of that so let's go ahead and click on start for free and add in our email address after that you just confirm your email address so i'm using a temporary email i just click on the confirmation link and i add my password and we should be good to go so now we just simply click on the save button and we log in and here we go so now we are logged in and this is your dashboard so over here you will see you have your contacts your funnels your emails your blog, your products, your sales, all of that, right? You have all of your data right here. As you can see, it has a new lead, but that's because we just created an account. So yeah, now let's go ahead and create a free landing page. So if you wanted to know why uh, a landing page is important, it's because when you create a funnel, right? So I think it's best if I show you as a drawing right here. So over here, I'll show you. So this is how it basically works, right? So you have a funnel, right? It can be emails, uh, campaign ad, whatever it is, right? So you have a funnel. When people go into that funnel, uh, they're going to be taken over to the landing page where people can see all the products, information, and all of that. Here is basically where they converge, all right? Here is where you make your conversions happen, whether or not they're successful or your failure. And if they come onto the landing page and they buy your product, they buy your service, they buy your course, whatever it is that you're selling, they buy it, you have now a successful conversion. But if they don't, you have a failed conversion. You can go ahead and go back and see why they it failed. Uh, was there too many steps and whatnot? So that is why a landing page is important. So that is what we are going to do. So here in funnels, as you can see, I don't have anything yet. So we're going to create one. So to create a funnel, we're going to click on create button right here. And here we are going to give it a name as to what it is you want to create. And then down below, you want to select what it is that your final goal is, right? Whether you want to build an audience, basically collect a email list for your project, custom build your own custom funnel from scratch, run as an evergreen webinar, or sell a product or service. For this one, we're going to select sell a product or service, and we're going to type the name test for now select the email and then for currency we're going to go with us dollar and click on save and here we go so we have now created a funnel all right we're going to click on it and open it up and here is basically where you go ahead and create a form right so this is going to be your funnel and then this is can be a thank you page or whatever you want basically a landing page over here right so let's say that since this is your landing page we can select something that you know works for it uh something like this book your package all right over here you will see a bunch of different themes we are on page number nine why are we on page number nine but yeah uh if you're wondering how you can add a funnel or maybe you know there's all should be a step number one you can click on add step right here and create what type of step you want so here you can say you know this is where you will find your main options such as a link in bio upsell downsell thank you page whatever you want to add it and then you can name it whatever you want right so here is the step configuration here you basically create the page and so let's preview this one because i really like this one and here this is a perfect uh, landing page people saw your ad people saw your email whatever it is that you sent as a funnel right and then when they clicked on the link they are taken over here where they can book a package book a call get more information about the product and if you want to add like a, a buy page or you know confirmation page or payment plan you could choose something like this one where they come over here they buy the product for themselves and yeah so you can choose whichever one you want it depends on you let's say we want to select this one right here for the uh, payment ones we click on select all right 
and now we can go ahead and edit that page out by clicking on this button to make a few changes you know what i mean set up uh change the logos the colors the text whatever it is you want to do so we click on edit page it's going to open up theme right here here is where you can go ahead and change your page since uh you don't have like huge special website and you have multiple products you don't have those th type of things uh, you can just simply add a whatever it is that you are selling or your product whatever it is you can say it like here like it's for example a book you can add like the book image over here uh it's titles over here reviews over here and all of the good stuff right and over here confirm and pay you can change it to whatever you want you can add your own text your own twist to it so let's say uh, over here, instead of company name, all right, we select a first name and tax number instead of tax number. What is that tax number? Uh, we select our last name, right? First name, last name over here, like so. And instead of these, we don't need these because we already have them right here. We'll delete these boxes and we shall move this over here at the top will delete this entire row as well there you go much better so first name last name the email their phone number we don't need the zip code unless you do then you can go ahead and click over here click on a zip code and change whatever it is that you want so let's say we already have a country let's say we select city right city is much better a lot of people know that so there you go and in the phone number right here you can have more options where you can add let's say placeholder is this one that looks good one number looks good yeah once you have everything then at the down below you have your pay with all right credit card or debit paypal whatever you want for this one you have to add uh, like a payment method but you know you can do that later on as well so let's say after that you are good to go you can add a cancellation policy cancellation fee book now confirm and then you have your pricing over here and let's say once you've done everything once you've fixed everything you don't want to make any changes you just simply click on save changes and you are good to go after that you can just simply go ahead and click on this arrow to exit it out now next is really really cool next you have automation roles this is where system me or system me dot io shines here you can add different rules so here whenever a new sale is made or whenever a sale is canceled page visitor whatever you want to add right whenever a new sale is made all right we'll click over here add an action we'll say send an email all right to a specific email address or enroll them or we can say send email to a contact and over here you select the contact you select yourself so that you get notified or what you can do is whenever a sale is made you can select basically you know subscribe to the campaign which you already have and over here you can select that campaign which you have and then you can save the rule it's that simple so after they've made the purchase or, or stuff like that right they are then taken over to the thank you page where you can select a thank you page so select whichever one you want and you should be good to go so we're going to select that and boom there you go that it's as simple as that whenever this happens they'll be taken over here so it's as simple as that so once it's done you are good to go so very simple this is how you do it this is how you create a landing page of course you can edit it out however you want you can add your own videos your own images your own text whatever it is you want but basically showed you how it is basically done so very simple this is how you do it this is how you add a free landing page for your facebook ads so thank you guys for watching hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did be sure to hit the like button subscribe to the channel and turn on post notifications and i will catch you guys in the next video and until then take care and goodbye